Now, as everyone knows, jawbreakers are by far the most important mineral in the world. But at first these rocks just look like colourful bouncy balls. The first thing to do is to make sure these gems appear to have circles inside of them. This means that they are indeed jawbreakers rather than their imposters, porcupines. As you may notice, some jawbreakers have little markings on them. These rocks are spun around in a giant pot while a scientist skillfully extracts all of the salt out of them. Immediately, everything is scooped up and plopped down into yet another machine. In this one, the colorful markings are sucked up by a man with a vacuum permanently attached to his hand. While well, those jawbreakers are already ready for the next step, these full-colored jawbreakers are not. Another scientist uses a magnetic ice cream scooper to harvest all of the dye. You may know this dye as cough syrup. Then the man must attract all of the salt like before. This time it is kept in a giant silo to let it be created into bathing salts. Then the scientist harvests the rest of the cough syrup until the colored jawbreakers become much much smaller and the same shade as a decade old tennis ball. They are then sucked up and pushed back down again to lower the self esteem. Soon after they are pushed back up through shredders to ground them into a fine sand which makes up, fun fact, around half of America's beaches. Now, some jawbreakers have a much softer center. These are separated into groups. He asked why, but the factory responded with, it's a sacred. Now, what is truly fascinating is after this, the balls are sucked up and turned into real life living play dough snakes. Soon after, these snakes slither the way over to the next station. The next station, they are connected with other snakes to make a few larger snakes. Now, these snakes slither their way into a tube where they are fed so much they emerge fatter. Then they are instantly combined into wet cinder blocks, which after are given a shower and then torn apart into a gooey mixture. A scientist extracts all of the orange juice which is packaged and delivered to grocery markets the same day. They are then mixed until little ping pong balls show up, which are sucked up by a shop back. After a few seconds, the cinder blocks are finally dry. After they are frozen together with an axe. After a few seconds though, they are melted again and sucked up into little tiny highways. Though this takes a while, this step is extraordinarily important, for reasons I do not know why. Once the flour is extracted, they are melded into something that resembles a French toast stick. Now, while the pixie stick dust, also known as sugar, is sucked up. Now, next time you look at a jawbreaker, just remember, they all creepily disappear. Thank you, this has been How It Is Unmade, and I'm your host. Please leave a like and subscribe. Stay tuned for next episode, which I'm not sure if we'll actually make. Bye.